this Minnesota United team you guys beat last year uh, two times. What have you seen from them so far in the early going? Oh, they're dangerous, you know. I mean, they, they went to Portland, and although the result wasn't uh, what they were looking for, they thought they had a good game. And, you know, they were they were dangerous. They scored a bunch of goals. Um, Thomas uh, dominated possession. Uh, so so they're obviously not afraid to go into hostile territories and 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 play with confidence and see if they can get something out of a game. So it'll be a, it'll be a tough test. I think uh, they had some growing pains last year, but uh, they're a dangerous side. They made they made some new acquisitions as well, and we're. We're familiar with uh, Quintero and what he, what he brings, so uh, it's going to be dangerous. They're a team that's been very cross-dependent, at least uh -huh. until uh -huh. signing Quintero. With those two center backs in front of you, how does that change your game plan versus other teams less cross-dependent? Well, I mean, you, you, cross is such a vague term. I mean, you think that with such, such big guys in the back that uh, we would eat those up all the time. but. Uh, I think uh, a cross can also be you going to, down to the byline and, and putting a, a, a ball in on the ground as a cross, you know, and that's so height's not really going to help you out there much. Um, um, I, I, I think it's it's good when teams uh, are are willing to cross the ball early, uh, maybe put balls in between goalkeepers and and retreating defenders. It, it puts players in awkward awkward positions, and and sometimes something awkward may happen. Uh, and overall, I think uh, you can you can mount pressure on teams by crossing balls a lot. Uh, you know whether it uh, it leads to a goal or it may lead to multiple corners or whatnot. But uh, I think that can that can change the sway of the game uh, and, and and which team is kind of dictating a little bit more. So uh, we're aware that they've uh, they've been crossing I think the most uh, in the league so far, and they're not afraid to do that. So uh, we're, we, we've practiced a little bit to make sure we're ready. Um, but I think we want to be the ones putting them on the back foot uh, crossing. Getting shots off uh, and and playing mostly in their in their half if possible. Steph, for you, how much of an influence is Oz when he comes in the game against Old Kids? Slows things down and how important is he going to be this weekend? Uh, it, was, it was really good just to see him get back after you know a, a lengthy lengthy spell on the sideline. I know uh, I always. Uh, feel for those guys because I've been in a similar situation. Uh, um, so it, it's always really nice um, to see someone's hard work uh, bear fruits. Um, and so for him to come back was was, was, was great. I was, uh, I was really, really, uh, maybe I shouldn't have been impressed, but I was impressed by how confident he was right away. You know, and when you've been gone for so long, usually uh, it takes you a while to get back into the groove of things and the sort of swing of things. But uh, he, he was demanding the ball. He was confident in close spaces. and, and so that was very, very nice to see him uh, almost uh, um, keep going where he left off last. So uh, it's good for us because we, we can use the help and the confidence. And uh, and I'm hoping that he can, uh, you know, slowly get more and more minutes and uh, and stay healthy. Any special plans for your birthday? Uh, my wife planned something. I don't know. She's the boss. So <laughs> um, it was weird because usually uh, Brad, Brad Evans and I, we have the same birthday. So. Uh, we would have to sing to each other before practice, and now I had to sing to myself, which was awkward. <laughs> um, but no, uh, I like a low-key birthday. Maybe a good meal would be nice, but we'll see what happens. What kind of meal? What, what was your favorite meal? I, I, I like food, uh, so uh, <laughs> it doesn't really matter. I'm, I'm sure my wife is not taking me to a place I don't like, so we'll see. I'll, gi I'll give you, I'll give you a, a review on where she took me after. <laughs> All right. <laughs>